The Cameroon National Youth Council, Northwest Bureau, recently organized a dialogue session with youths of the region on how they can contribute to peace and development of the region. We are currently doing the right thing and I think it's the best thing to do. Dialogue is the principal thing for any resolution and for any conflict in any region that we want uh, peace to reign there. Without meaningful dialogue, it's very difficult for us to uh, progress in this uh, society. The regular presence of the national president of the Cameroon National Youth Council in the Northwest region is a boost to the youth of the region. Uh, she facilitates their projects to be funded. She has facilitated uh, their voices to be heard. She has facilitated their plight and she has taken it down to our minister, the Minister of Youth Affairs and Civic Education. Why not the head of state, His Excellency President Paul Bia? And I've gotten all these challenges that the youth in the Norway are facing and are looking into it. That is why she is there for the dialogue that what is actually the thing that is disturbing the youth in the Norway region. She is here to address those issues. The regional president also encouraged young persons to get their names on the electoral registrar. We've brought the consciousness of youth knowing fully that they can be part and parcel of the electoral process. How can they even vote a young person to be their voice if they are not part of the electorate? Those are the things that puzzle us. That is why we are bringing the advocacy, encouraging all the youth in the Norway's region to run in for election, get a political party, write your name into the electoral list, rally the youth behind you so that they can elect you into the office for you to actually bring the dreams of the youth to reality. The dialogue platform also serves as a channel to educate the young people on the dangers of hate speech and xenophobia as well as cyber crimes.